Hello managers, I'm Thomas Rye, and this is a special edition of FIFA Rosters on YouTube. I am releasing one of the top features, in my opinion, and it might be in yours too once you see it, one of the top features to come to the site since, really since its inception. Uh, I feel like this is a culmination of really everything that FIFA rosters was meant to be. And so without further ado, let's just take a look. This is the FIFA rosters formation view. So here you can see my Fleetwood Town career. This is a, actually an old career, but it had uh, a number of players that I had taken through several years. Right now I have them in a 41212. And this is just kind of a, a quick glance at the initial view. You can drag your players and drop them. You'll see two things that happen there. One, these guys flip places. Two, they also change the information on the card. So now Pinto is a center back and it shows what his rating is at a center back. So that great tool that I feel like everyone comes to FIFA rosters for to see what their players would be rated in other positions. Now you can see it directly in the formation that you use in your career mode, and you can just play with this all day long. So Vinicius, uh, this guy, um, we'll just drag him down to an empty slot. He's actually a left back. He's an 84 rated left back, but he's so good. You can see some of his stats. He's really well rounded. And so I can put him in at left back, but I often ended up playing him at CDM because I had a really fast left back that came in. Youth Academy guy. So you can play with these guys. Um, Barros, you might notice this guy is the same one from the FIFA rosters homepage. Uh, he, he's a, originally a right back and I just drag him down here because it's the easiest way to show. Um, so obviously I don't want to play him in at left back because he's only a 68. Obviously he's got this low defense, but I started playing at him at striker. Amazing. And he actually plays pretty well on the wide midfield positions as well. So you have your guys set, but maybe you're thinking, you know what? I need to change this up. I'm going to go with the 4-3-3. It's gonna flip on the fly and show you. It's gonna change your guys around. So obviously you're gonna to wanna to move some positions here, you know, see where your guys are gonna fit best. Let's put Sterling there. You might need to bring in a different CDM. Uh, this guy, pretty good in everything defensively. Um, yeah, anyways, so of course, you know, once you get it in there, you're going to want to save your squad. Saved. And the old view is still here, so you can click over to your list. I'm just going to leave it at that for now. I hope you guys like this new feature. I'm really excited to be releasing it. I just, I've been working really hard on it, and I'm, I'm really glad that it's gotten to where it is and it can be a new function for the site. Uh, find me on Twitter, at FIFA Rosters, or comment on this video. Please let me know what you think, if you've got improvements to tell me about or new ideas, and definitely let me know whenever you see a bug or something going wrong. I try to respond really quickly. You can email me, find me on Twitter. I did set up a subreddit uh, for FIFA Rosters. You can just find it, I think it's slash r slash FIFA Rosters. So you can report bugs there too, or even share your players. That's one of the other new features. You can just put your links to your best players in there. We'll have fun. Anyways, I will let you guys go. Um, I'm Thomas Rye. This is FIFA Rosters with a brand new feature release. Uh, and until next time, keep doing what you do best. Lead them to the cup, especially by using that new formations view.